So we all witnessed that historic flooding in South Carolina. We watched it on the Weather Channel throughout all this week. So much rain fell. It's really hard to comprehend what that much water looks like. So we've come up with a way to try to help visualize just how much water fell in total. So we know some areas got about 24 to 27 inches of rain. Some areas got four inches of rain. So take an average across the state and let's say that all across the state about 10 inches of rain fell over the entire state and that equals roughly 5.56 trillion gallons of water. Oh, that's what trillion looks like. Okay, so in acre feet, it's a measurement that we use for a body of water, like a lake or rivers. Um, so one acre foot of water, let's see what that looks like. If you take an acre of water and you put it down on a football field, it's roughly the same size, but it leaves you a little nice border all around it. So it's not quite exactly the same. Pulled out of that water in a cube and it next to a six foot tall person just to see what we're talking about. And we're looking about an acre foot of water next to, hey, that's me. Um, look at the size. It dwarfs the size uh, of an average six foot uh, person. Well, that's not enough water because we're talking about much more water than an acre foot. So let's get bigger. Over, incredibly, over 24 inches of rain fell in parts of the Palmetto State. So we're going to have to get really big to do this. You think of the Statue of Liberty as a pretty big building. It stands about 305 feet tall. Look how much 1,000 acre feet of water is next to the Statue of Liberty. No, nope, keep going because it dwarfs this thing. It's not even close to the amount. All right, take another building. The Burj Khalifa is one of the tallest buildings in the world, if not standing over 2,700 feet tall. What if you took a million acre feet of water and put it next to the Burj? All right, here's what it looks like. It's a whole lot bigger than that. It's wider, it's taller, it's deeper. Keep going because it's taller than the Burj Khalif. Let me step back just a little bit because what we're about to do now is going to get huge. An average of 10 inches for the entire state of South Carolina, as we said, equals more than 5.56 trillion gallons of water and rain. That's more than 17 million acre feet of water. It's incredible. Now, Take that large body of water, take the comparison down to the ground. There's the Burj Khalif, and then there's the Statue of Liberty. That amount of water just wanted to show you in some way that we could how much water we're talking about flooding these communities and now making its way to the coastline. It's bigger than just about anything we have a way to visualize. It's wild.